Hey there, welcome to Techie Tuesday. In today's episode, we're going to cover a trick to help teach students how to summarize. If you're anything like me, um, writing a summary can be a little bit tricky. I tend to uh, forget some relevant information or important information that I need to put in there. Um, and one of the things that I found over at my friend's um, blog at Reading in Room 11 is that she had this uh, Google Doc that kind of puts everything in order for you. Um, so I've shared the link below to this Google form. Uh, you can, or Google Doc, you can actually click on that link and it, make a copy for yourself and use it. What you're looking at now is, uh, is the blank form. This is the form that you will see. Uh, so the first thing that you'll want to do is you'll actually want to go and share this with your students. So up here in the top right corner, you share it with them. Um, or assign that through your Google Classroom. Um, and what you want the students to do is actually um, just look for words or m maybe a small phrase of relevant information, um, important information. So when it looks at when, um, we're talking about what type of month or year, is it winter, is it fall? You know, what is in the story that can help you summarize what basically the plot is about? Um, once they have filled this chart out, it would look something a little like this, okay? So um, you basically you have the important parts. And the great thing is, is now your students can go and put this in a paragraph, and they can actually stay in this order. So one of the cool things about um, the color coding is that um, they each mean something. So the blue can actually be combined into your introductory sentence. And you'll see an example of, of what I'm going to do in just a second. Um, red can be combined uh, for the next sentence and green can be combined for the closing sentence. Um, so it just kind of gives your, your student um, a guide as they write their summary. Um, after the paragraph is written, um, of course you'll be able to see it. Um, you know, they could actually write it below this if they wanted to, which you shared it, so you'll be able to see it. Um, give the students a choice on how to report it back to the class. One cool app that is out there right now, and kids love using it, um, and this is what I'm going to show you my example in, is Chatterpix. Um, and so what I'm going to do now is show you my little Chatterpix that I put together um, in less than five minutes um, after I wrote my paragraph. Um, so here it is. One winter, Etu and his family were in the village. They were hunting mammoth to survive with food, clothing, and shelter. This was Etu's first hunt. Okay, so I hope you liked this episode, and don't forget to subscribe and check out onetickydude.com for more information. And as always, if you need anything, let me know. Thanks.